Okay, I kind of got you mounted on the on the mill head, the head of the milling machine. Uh, right now, the machine is sitting at zero. Zero is supposed to be the top of this uh, plate. I've got it uh, above. I'm going to uh, start it, and then I'm going to come down when it's making the cut and and just touch, and then we'll see how it work, how it goes. So. I'll get back over here to the control on my laptop, and we'll see what we can do here. Run the simulation first, and I just ran the simulation. Everything looks good. Okay, I'm to stop here. I get the coolant going here. I'll make sure I get coolant up here. All right, we'll start over here. I'll put it back down the console. Try it again. The V should be down. I'm just gonna. I just crank the V up and don't touch. Right there. Then if I turn this light off, I don't know which way is better, if light off or light on. I will push it into a fast time somewhere around when I get start moving the full depth. set my Z so I'm gonna crank this back down a little bit I would just that was just a little test to make sure that my moves were correct and they looked correct I'm gonna move move back to my zero point and now that that end mill should be touching the top so you can see we're set above quite a ways above so because I had cranked it down I'm going to grab a piece of foam paper here, and we'll attempt to set this. We're setting at Z0 right now. All right, so there's Z0. I'm just going to jog the Z up now. With uh, that's, I, I adjusted my knee, so so moving the Z0, uh, the quill up, that stays set in the console. So now we're going to go do some, now we're, this time it's going to be for real, we're going to do some milling.
Okay, that's it for the spoke area and the perimeter of the wheel. I'll finish cutting this off uh, with the bandsaw and then finish it on the lathe. I finished turning it after I put it on the shaft. So I'm going to have to do another setup and we're going to cut the spokes in it. So I'll come back when I'm starting to uh, cut some spokes.